Hey Pisces, this is going to be your love reading. You're the very last sign to do, so all the other signs is already up. So if you're dealing with any other placement or you have any other placements in your chart, make sure you check out those readings. Now I did do a June love prediction reading, so you can go ahead and check that out as well. The giveaway is already up on my Instagram pages. You can find both Instagram pages through the link in the description box. Make sure you fill out the step-by-step -step rules for you to be considered entered. Um, What else? You can book your personal readings through the website that is in my description box, which is um, my website. I sell some Palo Santo, Sage, Healing Crystals, um, my Oracle deck that I created, the Mass Feelings Oracle COVID-19 edition is also on there. So make sure y'all check that out. Thank you. But I'm going to get started on y'all love reading. I'm actually going to turn the AC on because I'm already sweating. It's hot as fuck already. So let me turn this thing on. I'm sorry, y'all. And I did this in the beginning of the video. That's so ghetto. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm not even gonna edit it out. Fuck it. Okay, so Pisces, what's going on in your love life right now? Okay. So you could be dealing with an Aries. I see that you either started fresh with someone from your past or you're starting new with someone in general and the feelings are very strong. The feelings are growing strongly. And with the Queen of Wands as well, it's like, um, it's like the feelings low-key surpassed I like you or I have feelings for you and it's growing into I love you, I want to be with you. So if you're starting fresh with someone or if you're in a new connection, just know this person's feelings is growing quickly and strongly. If you start fresh with someone from the past, just know that they have a lot of love for you. Which once again, I'm assuming that you may have, um, you're dealing with someone new with the Ace of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Alrighty, let's see again. Let's see now. So Pisces, how does your person feel about you? Whether you're dealing with this person or not, how does the person that is on your mind feel about you? How does the person that's on your mind? You could be dealing with a, um, a Cancer or Pisces. How does your person feel about you? The person that is on your mind. Okay. See, it could be someone new. I feel like this person has a lot of feelings for you, but they're hiding the actual amount of feelings that they have for you. I feel like they're unsure if this will be a stable connection. I feel like, um, clarification on the King of Pentacles reverse. Yeah, they're, they're in their own head. They're feeling like, is this going to be something? Is this going to end up something serious? Like, how is this going to end up? How is this going to... How is this relationship gonna go? Like I see that they're catching feelings for you, they're happy with you, but they're unsure of um, if it's gonna get anywhere. And I feel like that's why they're hiding their feelings because it's like they don't know if it's gonna go anywhere and they're just like, let me not express my feelings or let me not get too deep to where, um, what you call it, to where I'll end up getting heartbroken if it doesn't become anything serious. How else does this person feel about the Pisces? Make sure I like this video, please, and thank you. How else does this person feel about the Pisces? You can purchase this Oracle deck through the link in my description box. I want you, I told you, I told you. Okay, so I want you came out. This person wants you. They have feelings for you. I'm trying to tell you, their feelings is very strong. Now, <clears throat> now I didn't know who to choose came out I don't think that it's they didn't know who to choose as if you know it's you and someone else I feel like they don't know what to do like they don't know if they should continue hiding their feelings they don't know if they should go towards the moon card continue hiding their feelings continue hiding how they feel or go towards the ace of cups let their feelings be known let their feelings you know um, be exposed basically like they don't know if they should share it or not and then I hope you can forgive me. Whatever happened in the past with y'all or whatever happened recently with y'all, they're hoping that you can forgive them. Um, I see that they're very regretful. Your person may even be religious, whether it's, you know, um, they practice Islam or Christianity or Catholic, like whatever it is, your person may be religious. Because as you can see, this person is it's the Bible right there. It's the Bible right there. So your person could possibly be religious. Keep that in mind. 
or you could be the one that's religious. Then I got ashes all on my table. Alrighty, so next is how you feel about this person, Pisces. How are you feeling about this person? How is Pisces feeling about this person? How is Pisces feeling about this person? I think this card flipped over. Yes, it did. You could be dealing with an Aquarius. The star card came out. How is Pisces feeling towards this person? I see that you have hope for you two to like actually be something serious. Yeah, you got hope that things could be serious. I see that you're really giving this person your time and attention and you can actually see yourself with this person but just like them, you're afraid that things isn't going to go anywhere with the three of wands. You're afraid that it isn't going to go anywhere. You're afraid that is it, it isn't going to be anything. Like, I see that you're low-key stressing. Like, okay, I have feelings for this person. I have hope that it could be something. I feel like it can be something. But it's like you're also thinking, like, damn, what if things end sooner? What if it doesn't go anywhere? Okay. How else do you feel about this person? Okay. Okay. I'm waiting for you came out. Sometimes I dream about you. Okay, so I'm waiting for you. I see that you're waiting for like a sign from them that the feelings is mutual. It's like you're waiting to see like, okay, do they like me how I like them? Do they want me how I want them? Like they're waiting to see before they express how they feel. I thought you were using me. I feel like at one point in time or even now, um, you, you feel like, they could be using you, whether it be financially or something that you have that you feel as if they're going to use you. And then sometimes I dream about you. We are, Mercury is retrograding, so that's understandable if you do dream about this person. You know, our dreams is very vivid and graphic, so that's very normal. Um, but I see that you do tend to dream about this person at times. Okay, let's see. What's the outcome between you and this person? What's the outcome between you and this person? Okay, so let's see. What's the outcome between you and this person? I'm sorry, y'all. I ended up getting a call. My video's been fucking up lately. My Aquarius video, my camera just kept shutting down. Okay, so what's the outcome between you and this person? So we have the Tower reversed, Knight of Swords, Six of Cups. I honestly see that you two are gonna have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation and y'all are gonna speak about the trust issues that y'all have due to the past. So I feel like soon enough, very, very soon, you two are going to communicate about how you feel about one another and you're gonna communicate about what you two been through in the past with past lovers, past friendships, or maybe even childhood trauma. It's like you two are gonna sit down and have a talk to really understand why you're like that, why they're like that, not in a bad way, but just an open conversation as to why you two are not being upfront about your feelings. And with the Four of Pentacles, I see that you two are gonna hold on to each other. You two are gonna stick it out. You two are definitely going to, um, honestly, I see you and this person being together. If not being together, then, you know, like I said, working towards being together. Like I see you and this person, y'all are gonna open up, say how y'all feel and, that's that keep it pushing but i hope you guys enjoy this reading make sure y'all like make sure y'all subscribe once again the giveaway is already up on both of my instagram pages you can find those instagram pages through the description box and go ahead and enter the giveaway ends june 7th that's right around the corner so make sure y'all enter i'm picking three winners but thank you for watching you guys bye